Well, the movie is basically about this, this aging reprobate, who of course is Leon, and this young African boy of about 12 years old, and the kid's dog, and this orphaned baby rhino, who set out to kidnap the Nambodian ambassador and hold him hostage until he stops the rhino trade, which goes terribly wrong. And that's where a lot of the comedy lies. But these four eventually have to take on a platoon of ruthless poachers, and they end up as an example and an inspiration to the world. The initial idea was, well, let's do something about rhinos. Just to get a summary of, let's say, five pages down was mind-blowing difficult. Jeff Newton did the initial breakdown, which is a scene-by-scene -scene breakdown. He bounced it back to us. We picked it apart. I think I probably did the second draft of that. And so it goes that, you know, we did 14 drafts of the script. And Menzi Tabete um, had recently become my, my partner. He's a young man. It was not easy at all to raise finance within six months, you know, so that this movie can be shot last year and be released this year. So Menzi then went around and he sold it to the necessary people. And then Andre Skoltz came on later on, you know, because um, I'm not an experienced film producer, nor was Menzi, and we needed an experienced guy. So Andre came in and he provided the, the base. So over the period of three and a half to four years, we developed this thing, not full-time, but in the last two years, basically absolutely full-time. It was a good story, you know. It is Leon at the end of the day. <laughs> and we know what Leon is capable of. We saw that this thing was coming together, that the comedy and then the heart, the emotion. And that's a lot of what this film has in fact been about, is, is finding that balance. We weren't afraid that we're tackling a theme here that's too sensitive, labeled as a comedy. And I've always believed that, that laughter and crying run very easily hand in hand and juxtaposed to each other. Because if you're dealing with people's emotions, I'm talking about the audience, there you can, you, if, you, if you get them crying and then you hit them with laughter, it, uh, it really gets the, the emotions working. And I think it's a, it's a, um, it's a wonderful medium and I think we've succeeded.